Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah if you are new here and today is going to be a very fun video because we're going to be giving everyone in the new realm of magic pack a makeover. So if you guys are new to my channel, you know that I like to use a lot of CC in my gameplay. It's, I don't know how to explain my CC style, but it's kind of like a mixture of alpha and a mix of maxes. Uh, I don't know, it's kind of like a happy medium, at least it is for me. Yeah, that's just a little background of my <laughs> CC before we get into this video. I do want to do a CC video. Uh, I will do that very, very soon because a lot of you guys are asking for it. Before we continue our um, Realm of Magic Let's Play, I kind of wanted to get this out of the way because some of the characters have quickly become part of our storyline. So yeah, I'm just going to go to the Realm of Magic and then we're just going to give whoever we see a makeover. I hope you guys are excited. Let's get into this video. Okay guys, here we are in the Realm. These are our two girlies that we are playing with in the... Uh, in the let's play this is fiona she's good and this is flynn she's 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 not necessarily bad but she does have an evil trait so yeah those are our two girls just a little backstory so let's see let's see who's here right now who's this yeah that's not a magic person that's not a magic person either uh that's not either maybe we should just start off with the sages because we know for sure that they are magic people should we start off with him he is the sage of practical magic simeon silver sweater i cannot wait to do morgan i cannot wait okay let's just start with mr silver sweater here and here's mortimer again one of you guys said you think that he's our stalker and i could totally see that all right let's hop into create a sim and let's see what we can do with him uh he's a very interesting sim i'm not really sure if he is uh capable of saving but let's see he's a renaissance sim a geek he's gloomy and he's a snob very interesting traits and he doesn't even have a magical aspiration maybe because he already completed it all right let's see let's have a look at you dude your poor, poor lips. I've never seen a Cupid's bow on the bottom. Have you guys? That's pretty interesting. At least he has custom content eyes. I think because I have default eyes, so it's just like there automatically. So you have long brown hair. Let's just like take that off. All right, let's see. You have pretty bushy brows. Maybe we can do, I can finally use my bushy brow CC. All right, let's have a look at these bushy brows. Those, no, they're not really bushy. They're just more bold. He had like really thick ones. Um, I kind of, when I do these makeovers, I want them to still look like themselves. Like I want them to have the essence of themselves. Just, just better in my opinion, I guess. Oof, those are fierce, huh? Hmm. I mean, these ones kind of look like the ones that he had. Should we give him like the super, super, super like bushy ones? We could just work with those ones for now. He had brown hair, so let's... Oh, let's work on his skin details as well. Let's see what looks good on him. Man, I want to change his lips so badly. I'm gonna do it because like I don't really understand this lower cupid's bow like how do you even get rid of that is that like a mouth shape that comes with the game oh okay so it's just this mouth but it's like frowned interesting very interesting okay can we just make it like not frowned and maybe just, just a little bit, just a little bit. Help our mans out here. <laughs> uh, okay, lashes. He has a good eye shape for lashes. I'm jealous of him. Let's see, which one look? Ooh, those look really good on him. Okay, we'll do that. And then what skin detail is this? This is doughy skin. It actually looks good on him. Not gonna lie, it looks pretty good. And he's got a really wide nose. Hmm. I actually am feeling this one. I don't even know what that's called. I can't even read it, it's so tiny. 
But, oh, look at it. See? He's coming together. He's actually looking pretty cute now. I do like his brown eyes. All right, so now we have to find him long, a long ponytail. Should we give him this one? I've never put this on a guy before, but wow. That actually looks pretty dang good. Nice, luscious hair, my dude. Okay, let's see what other ponytails we have. There's this one. <laughs> Definitely not. No. Hey, I'm not hating this one either. Like, I could totally see a dude rocking this. Especially, like, a magical dude. Or maybe he can just wear his hair down. I don't know. He had, like, brownish gray hair. Like, he had brown hair and it's like, he's, like, starting to go gray. Oh, see? He looks so much better already. Like, so much better. You can have ponytails. That hair cracks me up for some reason. I'm gonna be honest, I'm not really like a huge fan of guys with long hair, but he looks good. This hair is very similar to the hair that he has in the game. Like a low ponytail, it's just missing those like, those front bang things. So that can be an option. There's like this man bun one. It's gonna be so hard for me to choose. Oh my goodness, it's gonna take forever. <laughs> oh my gosh, this hair. I just downloaded it. It's so beautiful. It looks so lifelike. This one too. Wow. Check that out. <laughs> okay, so this is the hair that he had, right? He had it in like the brownie spray. No, this is custom content. It's just a custom content clay hair, but it's so much better than the other ponytail. Okay, can you stop moving around? I'm trying to concentrate. <laughs> Ooh, there's this ponytail. Stop moving! <laughs> Jeez. Okay, big fan. Big fan of this one. Is there like a grayish one though? A brownish gray. No, it's just gonna have to be brown. I love this. Oh, look at that luscious hair. See, a guy could definitely have hair like that. It's it's totally possible. I think that's the winner. It's so much, it's very similar to his other hairstyle. So yeah, let's go with that one. All right, let's work on your outfit. Can I just say, I am so happy that The Sims fixed the skin details problem. Like, oh my gosh, I'm so happy. I don't know if it happened to you guys, but like every time I would go to like a different style of outfit, the skin details would not be there. So I had to apply them for every single outfit. And wow, that took so long, especially when I am filming and like someone ages up and I have to like do that all and film it all and it just makes like my file sizes so much bigger. <laughs> but now I don't have that problem anymore and I am so very thankful. I do have to apply lashes on every outfit though and that's pretty annoying, but that's understandable. Okay, let's work on your outfit now. He has a very rugged, style um this is a full body shoot okay um i'm just gonna add another outfit so we can reference back to this one so let's just take it off oh my god i'm gonna pretend like that didn't happen we're gonna have to change his skin details whoa okay that doesn't make any sense because this is clearly a guy in the thumbnail yikes okay there we go all better now <laughs> Well, that was interesting. Okay, let's let's see. Let's reference back. All right, all right. Let's see what we got here. First of all, let's see if there's anything in my custom content folder that is anything remotely close to what he's wearing. He's got like a, a long sleeve shirt with a hooded vest over it. That's gonna be difficult to find. So I have this hooded long sleeve that's pretty dang similar to what he's wearing in the first one. And then I think I have like an overcoat. It's not a vest, but 
I mean, that works out pretty nice. Let's see what colors there are. Oh no, it's clipping! No! Shoot. Hmm. At least the hair looks fine. He's got quite a belly on him. There's also this, like... Coat thing? Which I'm kind of a fan of? But I don't know if I want to use this on someone else, because that's kind of a good option. Maybe he should just wear this, like, long sleeve, like, strappy shirt. I do like that. Okay, so let's have a look at the pants. They are belted and very detailed. <laughs> I'm probably not gonna have anything of the sort. Let's see what's actually in the pack. Do you see what I mean about me mixing Maxis Match and Alpha CC? I don't know. I hope you guys don't hate it, but like, I don't mind it. I really don't. I think it's like some pieces look good together. Some definitely don't just because like how different they are, but I don't know. Sometimes it works. Like this is an option. I do like those pants. They look fine. Let me see what we have for custom content first. Before we commit. I really wish you'd stop flailing around. <laughs> There's these pants with this belt, but wow, that looks bad. What if he had this, like, little pouch? Is that magic? I don't know. I don't know. This is a lot harder than I thought it was gonna be. Like, way harder. Because I still want... I still want them to look like them. Oh, there's these. These are fine, actually. They kind of resemble those a little bit. Okay, and then as far as shoes go, I do want to keep those boots on him. Some kind of boot. It was these. Oh, man. Not gonna lie, they're pretty tight. I don't think I'm gonna worry about his other outfits too much. I am, however, gonna take that god-awful eye ring off. <laughs> Oh my gosh, why do you have shiny pants on? No, 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 no. That's better. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna worry about the rest of his outfits for now. I don't wanna spend too much time on each sim. But yeah, this is Simeon Silver Sweater. I think he looks way better than he did before. Let me know what you guys think. <laughs> okay, I think we're gonna do the girl next. The uh, mischievous magic girl. Um, hey, why are you still in that outfit? What the heck? I really don't appreciate that. Where even is that outfit? It's not even like an outfit for you, so you shouldn't even be wearing it. Whatever. <laughs> That's so annoying. All right, let's do it. What's her name again? L. <gasps> El Faba. She is a chief of mischief. She is a genius. She's a foodie. And she's mean. Okay, girly. Wow. Wow. That's all I gotta say. So you got like curly pink hair that's off to the side. So we'll definitely keep that in mind. Let's just take it off for now. Um, what skin detail? Like, do you have skin details on? Like, what is your skin tone? Oh, it's like gray. Hmm, we could keep that. Definitely taking the makeup off. Sorry, girl. And these brows. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry, but they gotta go. They're really archy and thin. So let's see what we could find. She has the permanent, like, face. Like, her eyebrows are always like that. That's kind of annoying. It makes me want to, like edit them okay these ones are fine they don't look too bad like oh i just really want to just like ah so much better <laughs> okay let's work on some skin details for her um she's got a very unique skin tone i don't think i've ever had a sim with this skin tone before Ooh. I don't know what it is about these two skin details, but they just make everybody look really pretty. Maybe it's just me. Oh, that's that one's nice. Okay, I think we're gonna go with this one. I don't know what it is. I'm really sorry. 
I feel so bad, but it's like one of my favorite skins. Should we give her a gap? Sure, why not? <laughs> All right, she needs some crazy makeup because she had crazy makeup and I like totally just took it off, but like it was so overwhelming. Is there, wow. Is there something else that we can do? I actually love this eyeshadow since I used it in my um, first Create a Sim challenge, the color one. It's actually really grown on me. I don't mind it much anymore. What the heck were they thinking with these freaking eyeshadows? Who wears makeup like that? Like, seriously, who? That ain't it, Chief. No, definitely not. I think this was the one that she had. No, it wasn't. Hey, this one's not bad. It's very, um... It's subtle, but like, in a de- in like a- How do I explain it? It's not as crazy as the other ones, but it's still crazy. Let's put some lashes on her, maybe that'll help. Oh my, wow. Those look so big on her eyes because her eyes are kind of small. Aw, pretty. Can I just? Sure. Okay, much better, much, much better. Oh, she's so beautiful, I love her profile. I'm digging her so far, I am. I definitely am digging her. She had like some other like funky, it was this. Oh my gosh, it actually looks cute now. <gasps> oh, I kind of like the black and white. Or should we do the purple and pink? Let's just do the black and white for now. Oh my God, so cute. I love her. Definitely not freckles. Yes, definitely that inner corner highlight. She's working it for certain. We can definitely give her some like crazy lipstick though. Um, ooh, pretty. Pretty, let's see, let's see, let's see. I mostly only have, hey, that actually looks really good. I mostly only have like lip glosses. <laughs> that actually looks good. I'm gonna keep it like that. She has such a pretty mouth shape. Okay, let's get some hair on her. So she had like, Parted down the middle, long pink. It was pink, yeah? Yeah, it was. Oh my god, she looks like Cher. <laughs> Is it just me or does she look like Cher? What the heck? All right, let's have a look. Maybe we should like randomize and see what pops up. Aww! So cute! So cute! Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. Let's let's keep looking. Let's keep looking. Ooh. Ooh. I'm feeling this one. That one's really nice. Oh my gosh. She looks so cute with I short it. hair. <gasps> I love it, guys. I love it. Should we keep it? Oh no, I don't know! <laughs> oh man, I'm so torn now. Because I do want to keep her like lovely long pink hair, but at the same time, that is just too cute. So is that. Ooh! Ooh! <laughs> this one looks a lot like her, her old hair, because it's like to the side and kind of like swirled down, which I think is supposed to be a braid. Um. I'm so indecisive, you guys. Like, so indecisive. Okay, it's between that one and the braid. I think I like this one better. Yeah, okay. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Let's see if she benefits from some eyeliner. There's this new one from Realm of Magic, which I'm really not a fan of. Like, not at all. <laughs> Ooh, I love the thick, 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 thick blown outline. That looks really good. What about a wing? No, I'm feeling this one for sure. Piercing? What do you guys think? Yes, no, maybe so. Let's have a look. That one doesn't really fit well. Um, the septum. Hey, that fits good. 
I love it when Sims have like a good nose for piercing. Ooh, yes, queen. Definitely, most definitely. And then I do like your eye color, but perhaps something else will fit better. Ooh. Those ones are just so much more striking, aren't they? Ooh, I love the silver. <gasps> I don't know. What do you think? Silver or pink? I think the silver is like a nice contrast with her eye makeup. Okay, let's do silver. She looks so cool now. Okay, so she's got a necklace on, which... I don't know. Should we keep it? Should we keep it? Should we keep the necklace? We've got like this moon one, which I think is pretty tight. Yeah, we'll do that one. And okay, she's wearing a dress from Realm of Magic. Um, we can put her in a dress. Let's do, let's see if there's any cool ones. Big fan of this one. It's really cute. It's dark blue and it has stars all over it. I know it doesn't really match like her hair and stuff, but I think that's really adorable. So I think, cause there's that too. Ooh, that's actually nice. Okay, let's see. Let's see what we can do to make it look not so formal. There's this like trench coaty thing, which of course clips. There's a sweater. Ooh, whoa. <laughs> that layering though. Dang it, I wish this didn't freaking, ugh! That's so annoying. Okay, I love that. Definitely putting that on her. This thing, I don't really know what this is. I think it's from vampires, but it kind of looks witchy, don't you guys think? I like it. We're gonna leave it. I like the, the balance of having those two things on her arms. And then as far as nails go, uh, pink for sure. Or like a purpley pink. And then for shoes, okay, that's pretty tight. That's pretty tight. And should we put a hat on her? I know that like witch hats are like super, um, cliche to put on witches. <laughs> But, I don't know. Oh, that's cool. I've never used that before. Oh my god, she looks like a freaking fortune teller. Oh, <gasps> I kind of like that. Alright, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I'm pretty sure I downloaded a witch hat. Ooh, look at this braid accessory. That is so cool. Can I get it in like a cool color? I don't know, does that look weird? Does it look like completely out of place or does it look like she did it on purpose? I actually really like it. Okay, it looks cool in like this blue or this pink, but I think we're gonna go with the pink because it matches the best. Um, as far as the witch hat goes, I can't find it. I swear I downloaded one. I swear it's in my CC folder, but it's just not showing up. Oh well, I, I love this. Oh, I think that's so cool. I'm definitely going to use it on a witch in the future because that's dope. All right. I spent way too much time on her, but here she is, El Faba in all of her glory. All right, guys. Next up, we have Morgan Ember. He is Flynn's current love interest. He like he has a spellcraft and sorcery aspiration. He want, He's ambitious. He's a bookworm, and he's also outgoing. All right, dude. So I'm honestly torn. I love the way that he looks already. I think he's super cute. He's straight up got lip gloss on. No judgment. I think that's so freaking dope. Um, but first things first, let's do skin details. I don't think he has any on right now. He doesn't. So he's just going to look better and better. I'm going to take off the lip gloss for now. Oof. Something about him, guys. Something about him I just really like a lot. I'm thinking we should do the V skin for him and perhaps the Goo Goo overlay. I love the Goo Goo overlay. That's a good one. All right, cool. 
Let's slap some lashes on you, because that changes a lot. <laughs> uh, dang, he's fierce, you guys. I'm feeling it. Okay, let's change these brows. Why does everyone in this pack have those brows? Are these new brows that came with the pack? That's cool. I've never, like, noticed them putting new brows in packs before. Dang. Not bad. Not bad at all. <gasps> Dang, you guys. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Wow, why does- Why does everything look so good on him? Like, look at these brows. Holy cannoli. <laughs> Each one I click, I just like better and better. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. Oh my goodness, okay. So, dude, these brows normally look horrible on my sims, but they don't even look bad on him. See what- He just has the perfect eye shape. Like, or perfect, like, brow shape. These ones are pretty fire. Like, those fit him really well. They're not too crazy. I did like these ones though, but they're a little like long. They look too tailored to be a man's brow. Those ones are a bit too angry. I like those. I really like those. Those ones are a little too bushy. Oh man, I think these are the winner. They look the most natural. I do love this hair. I am like honestly very tempted to keep it and I might depending. Uh, we'll see how uh, other custom content hairs look on him. I do like the curls. I think they look really good on him. Let's see. Let's have a look. Okay, there's this one. Definitely not. Definitely not. Definitely not. That one? Oh my god. <laughs> this is actually a good hair, but I'm not feeling it for him. Definitely not. I think he looks good with longer hair. Like, longer hair that, like, goes down. I don't mind this one. I think that looks pretty good. These are very weird swatches. There's like not a yellowy brown or yellowy blonde. This one looks pretty good. I'm kind of vibing keeping his yellow hair just because it's like such a like iconic thing for him. I like that one. It's so yellow though. It's like so yellow. Okay, it's between this one and what was it? This one. The more that I look at the other one, I like that one better. So we're just gonna go with this one. I have been taking way too long. I'm really sad that I can't find like the perfect hair. Oh well, I do vibe him having some face moles. Um, that one's nice. Okay, and then let's see what earrings I have. I should have downloaded some like Drop down like dainty dangly ear. Ooh, cute. Cute. I like those. Okay, these are pretty dope too. They're like in the ear, like triangle-y looking things. Yeah. Those are dope. Okay, we're going with those. We're going with those. I like the Helix. I do a lot. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. He has, does he have a full body outfit on? Where is this one? Show me, show me, show me, show me. Where are you? Okay, yeah, it is. Okay, uh-oh. I don't really understand these skin details and what they do to, <laughs> to the body. It's kind of weird, but whatever. It's fine when they have clothes on. See, he looks good in this. I wish it came in red though. That's Vlad's outfit. I can't unsee it. I can't put that in like any other sim just because it's Vlad's iconic look. Okay, I like this. I think it's cute. It's, it's, 
it's not as regal as what he was wearing before, but I don't really like have anything that even comes close to that. And I don't really want to like keep it the same because then it's not really a makeover, you know? So now I'm just trying to find some pants that might look decent, might make it look a little bit more magically. All right, guys, this is what I came up with. This is actually something from City Living that I have never used in my life. I didn't even know existed, but it looks like it was made for this pack. So yeah, I actually really love this. Let's check out this one, actually. Oh, how cute is that? Little flowers. Oh, the, see, a lot of the stuff from City Living, like, oddly goes with this pack. I think for his first outfit, we'll do this one, and then for this outfit, we can do... That one goes. A lot of the stuff from City Living goes. All right, there he is. There you go. His first outfit and his second outfit. He's very cute, guys. I'm obsessed. Okay, guys. <laughs> I didn't change anything. I just went to do his formal wear and I noticed he was wearing makeup and a dress. And I was like, okay, wait. Let me check something. Cause his clothing preference was feminine. So I was like, Oh, that's interesting. Was that just a mistake? But no, he has a masculine frame, a feminine clothing preference. He can't get pregnant and he can't get anyone else pregnant and he can't use the toilet standing. So what I'm thinking is he was a female, but is no longer a female anymore. Wow, and this is a Maxis made sim. I'm shook. That is so cool. Okay, so that was all of the sages, I'm pretty sure. So I think we want to do one more. And... Oh, let's do this chick. I think that would be fun. I'm not really sure who she is, but I know that she's from the pack. Dude, I'm so... I'm so... I'm so shook about freaking um, Morgan. Oh my gosh, I never even like... I suspected that at all. Okay, so she's a purveyor of potions, she's non-committal, she's a goofball, and she's romantic. Okay, see, I really like her look already. It's really cute. I think they did a good job with her. But <laughs> we're still gonna change you. Okay, so your eyeballs, they are very dark brown. That's fine, we could keep them dark brown. And then you have freckles. Should we give you a skin detail? So pretty. Ooh, yes, definitely. Definitely the V, for sure. <laughs> All right, let's slap some lashes on her. Oh my gosh, she looks so good with long lashes. <gasps> yup, and these brows are actually not bad either, but let's have a look at some other ones. Yes, queen. <gasps> Why is she so pretty? Holy crap. Holy crap. Okay. All right. So I definitely want to give her one of those new curly hairs that I downloaded. Um, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Where are they? I have too many hairs. Oh, there's the braids. She has braids currently. <gasps> okay. Big possibility there. Big possibility. Um, but I do want to see those other hairs. If I can find them. I have too many custom content. Here we go. <gasps> oh my god, so cute. Oh my god, so cute. <laughs> okay, where's that other one? This one. Wow. It's gi ginormous. It's huge but I love it. That's cute too, but I'm thinking I liked the first curly hair at this one. I don't know. It just looks so cute on her. Okay, we're doing that. We're doing that. We're doing that. You were super easy. You had bright purple lipstick on, which I did like, but I didn't like the, the gradient effect. So let me see if I have a better one. That looks pretty good. 
Okay, let's go with that one. And then what else can we give her to make her just a little more unique, you know? Perhaps a septum. Yeah, okay, we'll do that. All right, let's have a look at what you're wearing. This is another Realm of Magic dress. Should we put her in this one? <laughs> I'm still shook that they included this in the game. Like, this is so risque. I love it, but like, dang, Sims. Like, what are you trying to do here? Just curious. Oh, this is a cute dress too. I love it. I love it. What the heck? What pack is this from? Oh, probably the free update. Her first dress was very like school girly and like very put together and i do like that feel i love that i just love this dress so much one of our main characters wears it for her formal wear it's just so pretty and whimsical and i just love it i just love it i like this maybe she can wear this because it is um it's very similar to what she was wearing Cute. Okay, we definitely need to change the lipstick color for sure. Uh, let's see. Something that matches the... There we go. Cute. Okay. All right. And as far as her tights go, I do like them. But they kind of like clash a little bit. So maybe we should just put her in plain ones. Or fishnets. Fishnets are pretty cool. Okay, and then what shoes came with Realm of Magic? Did any shoes for females? Serious. Oh, lit. Just boots, okay. Do the boots even look good? I don't wanna force it, so we're not gonna force it. Let's see what other shoes look good with this dress. These are cute. I like. Okay. She's not really looking magic-y anymore. <laughs> this dress is pretty cool. This came with the pack. I really like the way that it looks on her. But I want to do something different. I just don't know what. Should we put her in the Wednesday Adams dress? That's pretty cute. With the little stars. We would have to change. I see these shoes. They're custom content, but they are so witchy. I absolutely love them. Okay, so it's either that or the dress we had before, which was not like magic looking at all, but it was really cute. There's this, which is super Sabrina the Teenage Witch. I kind of like it. Should we do this one? yeah let's do this one it does i mean it does look which you guys have to admit it definitely does she could wear like fingerless gloves with uh some rings that looks kind of cool and then dang it this this outfit would look so good with the witch hat oh no hats don't work with her hair no oh well Ooh, cute! Oh, I don't think I've ever used this before, but it is adorable. There's no color that really matches. Except for that one. Oh my gosh, I am so obsessed with her, guys. I'm so stoked right now. All right, love, all done. Grace Anansi. Okay, guys, I'm gonna leave this video right here. I don't want it to be too long and my eyes are starting to hurt. <laughs> Let me know if you want me to do more of these uh, Sims 4 Townie makeover videos, and I would be happy to. I love you so much. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!